Hello MMO fans, Matt Crocott here for Devil's MMO. Today we're going to take a look at Dota 2, or Defense of the Ancients 2, from Valve. Absolutely. It's a uh, MOBA game, um, an action RTS, if you will. Um, the what do you see? general idea Your in, in the review uh, that accompanies this video review, uh, which you can check out by reading the description, clicking the link in the description. Crescent steel. I, I'd say that it's a bit of a an RPG, almost. It's like a hundred hour RPG fit into 30 minutes. There's tension, there's storylines, almost. Scared. Um, there's rivalries, uh, there's people that you'll come to regard as uh, frustratingly evil. Um, and it's, it's fantastic, it really is. The genre as a whole is great for the people that have the patience to learn how to do it. It's a genre that is notoriously hard to get into because when you begin the people who have been playing longer will be more than happy to criticize and tell you exactly where you're going wrong. Um, the basic setup is that there are two teams, uh, in Dota 2's case, two teams of five, uh, facing off half of the map each. Um, you'll level up your character. There's a set of heroes that you can choose from. You choose one of the heroes, middle tower is under and attack. then you go ahead and uh, take down a set of oh, towers no. blocking your way, and the main goal is to destroy that big fiery thing only your on the good people's team, attack. or whichever team you might be on. I'm going to just skip forward a little here. The, each game can last uh, anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. It really depends on how skilled your opponent is and how skilled your teammates are. It's not a game that you can win on your own. Or at least not yet. You may find that um, it comes to a point where there are guides for every single character and the characters aren't a million miles away from what have been in previous Dota games and uh, copycat games. So if you've played the genre before, if you played uh, League of Legends or Heroes of New Earth, then yes, there will definitely be a lot of things you'll be familiar with. I mean, the map itself is pretty much standard for the genre. As you get to know your character better, you'll learn the best way of leveling them up. You will find a character that you'll become attached to, almost. At which point, <laughs> Thank you. Your middle tower is <laughs> under attack. Um, there will be a point where your middle tower is under you, attack. You uh, get to know a character well enough that you your know exactly where to be at what time, fallen. and that kind of takes the fun out of it. This early in the game, there's a lot of people who are just starting out in the MOBA Dota genre. Um, it's, um, it's nice to be part of that this early on because not everyone knows what they're doing and each game is completely different. You have to react quickly. There comes a point like this in every game and it's always very exciting where whoever's winning kind of falls in on whoever's losing and it just becomes a bloodbath. 
You can't escape the underscape. Your middle tower is under attack. Some of the things I like are the attention to details with the voices and that sort of thing. The characters will talk to one another. We ride once more. Your middle tower is under attack. Your middle tower has fallen. The graphics are fantastic. The music's decent. It's a very good example. Your of ancient is under attack. The genre. And you know you can see that Valve put a lot of effort into it. Your ancient is under attack. Here it comes. We're about to lose. I feel it was worth it anyway. For a more in-depth review, check out Devil's MMO. Link in the description below. Be sure to subscribe for further reviews, including the Heroes of Newest review coming uh, soon. Thank you very much for watching. We'll catch you again soon.